everybody today i will show you how to root samsung galaxy s duos 2 it's a new entrant that has been released in 2013 december so i guess it's a pretty good time to root your phone now okay let's get uh, started okay before uh, starting the process what you need to make sure is that you go to the settings in your phone and uh, then go to more <coughs> over here you will see developer options if the developer options part is not coming or it's not showing on your end then you click the about device five to six times the developer options will come so you go to the developer options <coughs> sorry make sure that this usb debugging this particular mode is turned on it's checked over here okay so now uh, as it is checked so it's okay now the main thing is that as you can see in my youtube video there are some files that i have kept at the bar, kept at the bottom to download uh, there is a odin version 3.04 file there is a recovery.tar file uh, update super suv file and a samsung driver uh, file so at first you need to install the samsung driver uh, in your pc or in your laptop whatever you are using and, uh, and after that what you need to do is that uh, you go to this recovery.tar you right click and extract here over here so once you extract it turns it to a uh, .tad.md5 extension as you can see recovery.tad.md5 so it's good to go <clears throat> okay now what you need to do is that you need to sw uh, switch your phone with data cable and connect it to your PC or to your laptop okay see it has read uh, so now what you need to do is that uh, you will find that here it says update super SUV version 1.34 this particular file you need to copy I just uh, you can copy this particular file yeah copy and then go to the phone file actually that says yeah oh, here it is okay now you go to the phone memory not the external card memory go to the phone memory and paste it over here see it came Super SU version 1.0 file that it's it's being pasted on the phone memory of your Samsung Galaxy S Duos 2. So now you uh, click it off and pull off the device from the data cable and switch off your device. Power off. Device will turn off. Of course, I want my device to turn off. Okay. Now once it's done off, what you need to do is that uh, you need, okay, now uh, you need to go, uh, actually I need to flash the ROM using Odin, so by doing that I need to go to the download portion, press the volume down key, the power button and the home key at the same time, just keep on pressing it, press the three buttons simultaneously at the same time, till this particular screen co comes. Uh, here you will say uh, it says a custom OS can be critical problems or stuff so that then there is volume up to continue so you press the volume up button so I press the volume up button and it will give you a screen like downloading stuff like that <clears throat> so now you go to your PC and laptop go to the uh, Odin file so now uh, what you need to do is that you go to Odin right click on it run as administrator it will prompt you to run as administrator if, uh, hit on yes yeah odin will open now uh, after odin opens you need to uh, plug in your device using the data cable to your pc or laptop see once you plug in this particular portion will turn blue actually it's mandatory that that portion turns blue if it does not turn blue then that means samsung keys is not installed in your pc or laptop but that is very important that pre uh, previously you need to install samsung keys also properly in your machine Okay, now after that, uh, once it turns blue, I need to uncheck this save dot reset time and this auto reboot but um, checkbox. Once those are unchecked, uh, here you will see PDA. I need to click on the PDA. Actually, I uh, you remember at first I have extracted the dot tad dot uh, um, extension file, so I need to go over there again. Just let me navigate to that portion. Yeah, here it is. YouTube. Ah, uh, yeah. Galaxy shows root files. Yep. Over here, you will see that recovery dot md5. I just need to select this particular file, PDI, um, uh, and uh, after that, I need to hit start. So you will see that yeah, the recovery over here it's going on. 
and it says reset and it says pass once you see pass you just need to exit this particular portion and just pull off your data cable now hold the volume up button the power button and the home screen button at the same time mind you this time you need to press the volume up button not the down button so keep on holding it till your turn and till uh, display comes to your screen yeah this particular display you can leave your buttons now so see once uh, it's over here it shows that it, you are actually in the CWM based recovery mode so once you are over here you need uh, you will see that a touch won't work over here so you need to navigate using the power up and the power down button and you need to select using the power key button so okay over here it says install zip as you can see see minutely it says install zip okay so I need to select that I'm just selecting it now it says choose zip from SD card install zip from sideload apply SD card update the CP so uh, actually I need to choose uh, zip from internal SD card because you remember I have copied that super SUV folder in my phone memory so it should not be from SD card it should be choose zip from internal SD card so again I'm selecting that okay now I'm again uh, I will actually navigate to that update that super SUV version 1.4 zip folder here it is I have used a volume up down button to navigate here and once you are over here you just select the power button it says no yes install update yes I need to install this particular update so I again hit the power button and you see in your screen uh, and then it says install from SD card complete so once this particular screen shows that install from SD card complete you again navigate to go back just sorry yeah now it says reboot system now so you select reboot system now so actually it will take some time to reboot so this makes sure that uh, the routing of your Samsung Galaxy S Duos 2 is actually done uh, please be online I'll just let you show that yeah the installation has been done properly and your phone is successfully rooted okay the Samsung screen is coming on yeah Android is upgrading starting the apps of course it will upgrade because after routing your phone is starting from, uh, for the very first time okay just give it some time because you will see the networks are not yet ready yeah the first network is ready okay this display went off okay let me swipe the screen and now let me navigate through the apps sorry okay navigate through the apps here you will see the file that says super su once this particular file is there you are actually sure that uh, your routing of the phone has been done it says, it says you to follow me on google plus or twitter it's up to you i don't need to follow no thanks so actually i uh, go to the settings enable super user everything is per turned on enable reauthentication is pro so it actually the, this actually makes sure that uh, the installation of super SUV is, uh, has been done and your phone has been successfully rooted and in case uh, just in case you want to unroot your phone you can go to the settings just navigate and you then uh, you can select full unroot so this will again unroot your phone maybe i'll make a separate video for that and let you show uh, let you guys see how the process is done okay so for now that's it this is the way how you can root your samsung galaxy s duos 2 okay guys please like my video and subscribe to my youtube channel for more interesting updates in the days to come thank you thanks